And the United Nations Security Council will convene an emergency session on Thursday. This meeting is to discuss the recent violence in Al-Aqsa Mosque. The emergency session is being held at the request of the United Arab Emirates. And this comes after clashes broke out at the Al-Aqsa Mosque in Jerusalem for the second time within a day. Now, until now, the UNSC has had three emergency mm -hmm. sessions over the Israel-Palestine conflict. And this will be the fourth since Netanyahu government came to power. On Wednesday night, Israeli police and Palestinians clashed yet again, only hours after 350 people were arrested in a police raid. Police entered the Al-Aqsa compound and tried to evacuate the worshippers here using stun grenades and rubber bullets. Police officials said dozens of youngsters brought stones and firecrackers into the mosque as well. Less than 24 hours before this, police had to resort to reading the mosque Raiding the mosque, pardon me, raiding the mosque to remove masked agitators who locked themselves inside. This resulted in a clash between Israeli police as well as the agitators, in which 12 protesters and two policemen were injured. Al-Aqsa compound in Jerusalem's old city is Islam's third holiest site, where tens of thousands pray during Ramadan. The clashes come amid the Ramadan and eve of the Jewish Passover holiday. Escalating clashes between police and Palestinians triggered protests in Gaza. Demonstrators waved mass flags, carried placards, burnt tires here. The clashes also triggered scores of people gathering outside Israeli missions in Turkish cities of Ankara and Istanbul. They chanted slogans against the Israeli police raid at Jerusalem's Al-Aqsa Mosque. Protesters have called for immediate end to the violence. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.